Well, here we are today, everyone. Today is the day that Godzilla vs. Kong finally comes out. And I hope you guys have your tickets ready, or if not, you're going to turn into HBO Max to check out the movie. I know I'm super excited about this. I cannot wait for it. So today, to celebrate the movie finally coming out after all this long wait, I'm going to show you guys the classic scene of Godzilla and Kong face-to-face -face roaring at each other. I thought this would be a fun video just to kind of end off the week. It's been an awesome, fun seven days doing all these different videos. I hope you guys have enjoyed them just as much as I have. And now, once the movie comes out, we're going to have all sorts of new scenes and images to draw from the movie. So remember, tonight is Godzilla vs. Kong. I hope you guys all get a chance to go out and see it. And thank you so much for all your support this week with all of the Godzilla vs. Kong videos. So for today's video, I hope you guys follow along and enjoy this one. Now to start off with this drawing, we're going to make it nice and big and we're going to try to fit as much of their faces in here as we can. So to start off right here, I'm going to begin with Kong's eye. So I'm going to begin just by making a little line that's just going to kind of go down and then it's going to come back like this. Then I'm going to draw a line that's going to curve right around here. I'm going to make a couple little lines right underneath here. And we'll add another little line up above it. I'm going to leave some space out here. I'm going to make a little line that's going to come out, and then it's just going to curve up, and it's going to come down to here. Then I'm going to start right here, and I'm just going to make a couple little curved lines right here by the eye with a little line that's just going to kind of go down here. Next, starting here, I'm going to make a line that's going to come up, and it's going to go down to form the nose. I'm going to bring this back. I'm going to curve it up here. I'm going to make a line that's going to come right down to here. I'll make another line that's going to curve over here. Next, starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's going to come down. It's going to come right to about here. Make a little line that's going to go out. And then I'm just going to bring it right down here. And then I'm going to curve it over to here. Next, starting here, I'm going to draw just some kind of long zigzag lines up here. I want to make a couple little broken lines that are going to come right down to here. And a couple more that are going to come right to here. I want to make a nice long line that's going to come down to here. Over here for the ear, I'm going to make a line that's just going to go down. That's going to curl right up to here. We're going to make a line that's going to go down and around. And then one that's just going to kind of curve right around here. Now, for the teeth, I'm going to start by adding a big fang right here. I'm going to add a little line that's going to go down and up, and then another one here. We're also going to put another fang that goes down and up. We're going to see another little tooth or two over here. And then right down here, we're going to see another fang. We're going to add a couple little teeth right at the bottom. And then we're going to add another big canine fang right there. Then starting here, I'm just going to add a little line that's going to come up. And I'm going to bring this down here. Now I'm just going to add a couple little lines right up here by the eye. Then starting here, I'm just going to make a nice little long broken line. And I'm going to make just a couple more little broken lines kind of right along the face here. Okay, so here's our basic shape of Kong. Now we need our basic shape of Godzilla up here. So I'm going to start right up here and I'm going to make the eye. So I'm going to begin just by making a little line. It's just going to go down and then it's going to curve back like this. Make a line that's going to go down. I'm going to bring it up. Make this line, little line, leave a little space and make a line that's going to go up. And then it's going to come right back to about here. And then I'm going to angle it back. We'll make another line that's going to go right off the paper. Now 
Then starting here, I'm going to make a line that's going to come up. His snout is not very long, so I'm going to make it go right to about here. And then I'm going to draw a line that's going to go down, and it's going to curve to here. And then I'm just going to make a nice long line that's just going to go up to here. Then I'm going to bring this line down, and I'm going to bring it out to here. Next, I'm going to make a line that's going to go down, and I'm going to bring it up. And then we're just going to make a little line that's going to come right up to here. Next, I'm going to take this line, I'm going to go out to here a little bit, and then I'm just going to curve it back, and I'm just going to add a couple more little curve lines right here. Then starting here, I'm going to make lines going to go down, I'm going to curve it right back up. And we're going to add a couple little lines right around it. Right back here, I'm going to make a line that's going to come right down to here. I want to add some of his teeth. I'm going to start with a nice big one right here, and I'm going to make a couple smaller one behind him. Then we're just going to make some sharp teeth right along here. I'm going to add another long one over here too. Then right in here, I'm going to add just some different size little teeth here. And then starting here, we're going to make a line that's going to come down, and then it's going to go right into here for his tongue. And we're going to add a few more teeth right behind it. We'll make a nice little line that comes down. I'm going to bring this line up a little bit, and then I'm just going to add a couple little lines that are going to go right off the edge of the paper. Okay, so we got our basic shape of our Kong and Godzilla kind of in that face-off roaring position. So now we just want to come in here and add some different details. I'm going to start by just adding a little circle shape right here. I'm going to add another one in here. I'm going to kind of add a little small one. I'm just going to color this in. I'm going to add a few little broken lines right around here in the eye. A couple little more lines right over here. I'm going to add just some quick little broken lines all the way around here and along the, along the top. I'm going to make some little lines coming down here. Then I'm going to make just some little lines kind of coming down, up and down the side of Kong's face here. Then I'm going to make some kind of zigzag lines over here. And just a few little curved lines around here. And I'm just going to add some quick little lines, nothing too crazy, just to kind of show where some of the hair and everything is. I'm going to add some over here, and we'll add most of this in with our coloring and everything. Just a few quick lines here. I'm going to add just a few more rows of hair. Get a couple line or two on his nose. Now for the eye of Godzilla. I'm going to draw a little line that's going to curve down. And another little line here, and I'm just going to add a little circle in here, and then we'll just color this part in. I'm going to add a couple little lines right here by his eye. Make a couple of lines go right across the top. We're going to make a few kind of long broken lines coming up towards the nose, and then a few that are just going to go straight up and down. Make a couple going horizontal too. Make a couple more little lines coming up here. Make a nice long broken line coming down, kind of show where like his lip would be. And then bring a couple little lines up here. I'll make another little line right here, kind of show where the other side of his mouth is. We're gonna make just a couple little quick lines in here where his mouth is stretching. A couple more little lines by his eye. And a couple more above it too. Make a couple little broken lines up here just to show some different texture on them. I'm going to bring these lines down and then curve them out and then in. I'm going to make this line go out and a couple more here. 
I'm just going to add some little pointed kind of curved lines on here for a little bit of spikes. And just some nice kind of long curved broken lines all along here. Kind of coming down too. And we're just going to add a few little lines in here just for some extra details. And there you go. There is your drawing of Kong versus Godzilla in the final face-off position. Hope you guys have been enjoying all these drawings and everything. I know I definitely have been enjoying drawing them. Some of them have taken quite a bit of time, but overall I think they've turned out pretty good. I've got to try some fun different poses and different things. So hope you guys enjoy this, and I hope you guys get to enjoy the movie today. I know I've got my tickets, and I'm ready to go. So thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed.